Hi, my name is Alanis. Hi, my name is Anna. Hi, my name is Akila. Funny enough, art is needed for everything that you look at. Yeah. Packaging, yeah, it graphics. This chair we sit in. Yeah. Like, all right, all it is. Your clothes, your shoes. Realize, people don't realize. I think people have a small view on what art is. Yeah, I think art is just painting and, and drawing. And sculpture and drawing and this, this, and this. The actual set of guidelines for what it actually is. Yeah. And then uh, sometimes art plays in a lot more things. Like, the same thing we were just saying in terms of art is like a chair or whatever. Yeah. Like, we might not consider it furniture because we might have created it with a purpose to show a whole a different art. concept or a different topic. So yeah. it's not really, it probably wasn't even made for the purpose of sitting necessarily. Yeah. What made you decide to go into art? And into the medium that you do, like you're into acrylic painting, um, oh, painting. Yeah. what else? Okay. Mixed media. Mixed media. So it's up to me, like, as in, when I decide what it is I want to say or any topic, then that's when I decide what it is I want to work with. Uh, sometimes I work with a lot of like, painting, ink, glass, leaves, wood, wood. <laughs> anything, just depending on what it is that I'm yeah. trying to say at the point in time. Well, I think I'm more traditional. But right now, I fall more into the traditional category of art. Portraits. Oh, painting and portraits, which was kind of the, the first, the original, the yeah. started. Yeah. Well, something that's a problem too because people are like, oh, you need to set more outside the box. But I comfortable and I learned a lot through oil, oil painting, so I don't really want to go outside right now. Yeah. If the topic I'm looking at calls for it, then I would. But oil painting is it for me with a portrait. I just like feel like in terms of using whatever medium. I like at the time to me once I set a topic, whatever. Whatever it calls for is what I use. But I always love color in everything. Especially so the like color theory. Like, like I just like putting like different colors anywhere, everywhere, making them work. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? What's your favorite <laughs> color? Lime green. <laughs> Lime green. Green everything is everywhere. Machine, at least. Yeah, yeah. What are y'all's co favorite colors? <laughs> well, so you know we love in their boots that right here, so y'all <laughs> can't see it, but. I like pink, but I don't wear it as much. Yeah, I like don't pink. wear it. But I don't wear my color either. Yeah, you don't wear it, but I feel like our room. Yeah, like your room. <laughs> I even have a pink garbage bag in my trash can. <laughs> like that's how serious the thing is. You know what? I am Barbados. Like to that topic, I understand where people are coming from because if you don't know about it, then you don't care, and there's not there's not there's not much outlets. To, to put your work out there because yeah. I don't even know there's a whole art society in Barbados that I don't even know about. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the fact that 
the art and soul is doing these art shows and helping young artists is important thing yeah. because there's not much people out there because so much artists when they leave the bachelor program or the associate program they don't do art anymore they need assistance that's the thing what? It's, a, it's a matter yes. of assistance they need assistance it's a matter of and helping managing helping people because i think everybody in the world kind of know like all for themselves yeah, yeah. So, nobody yeah. that's what we stay together because <laughs> any day is like if you help others and it's genuine there and right, helping you exactly. so it's like if you think about yourself self 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 sometimes yeah. you can never get anywhere yeah. so it's like that i feel like you don't really care about art either because yeah. like and then like even in the system for me you know, people have always discouraged you from doing art the teachers have been like oh that ain't important we can skip that class if we got extra classes yeah and then just be treated so badly from young that you just grow up thinking oh i can't use art so i don't really blame people for that much that is name the teacher that kind of set that into your head but like well, because of where we are in Barbados, in the Caribbean, where do you find your inspiration? Like, where do you get inspired? Pop our culture, basically. Yeah. Like, what's going on in the media right now? Like, I'm not gonna like. I'm yeah. not, I feel like when I get a topic from a teacher, not that we get topics anymore, but like, when I used to get topics, it's like a single word would give me the inspiration. That's, yeah. Because obviously everything is earth connected. So like sometimes I would hear a word and I would think of a song. Or I would hear a word and I would actually think of some photograph that I saw on Instagram. It's like anything that could add to your work. So it's like even watching TV or you laying on lazy on Instagram. Like any day, them things that help you with your art. Because yeah. they're adding imagery. They're adding, I guess, thought, song. All these different things that you can add into your actual work and your pieces. And I think like just anything that you do, just saying over right here so I get inspiration. Yeah. So let me be a space though. I just love looking at small things. Like silly, look at that piece of wood. Like when you zoom in on that, you just seeing so much things. Great. Like, stuff like that. So you would say art is very important to you? Yeah. yeah. For sure. I think it's a part of us. That's right. It's not like we study art because we want a job in art, not necessarily, but it's something that we feel like is a must, is a have to, not that. Yeah, we, can, we can put it aside and not do it. Yeah, cause then you just get this feeling like it'll just be chilling, and then it's like, oh, oh I gotta get a creative. I gotta yeah, get something. something. So, what is your goal with art? Do you plan to stay in Barbados with it and try to develop it more? Do you have goals to go overseas? Yeah. Or? I plan to develop it, but I still want to come back to Barbados. You know what I mean? Like, like, cause Barbados don't have everything for artists. Like people as far as they want in terms of um, studies. Yeah. So like, I want to get the only way I want to come here and like try to build something that will help support our kids after we bond to time and all that. Yeah. Well, my goal is well, right now I'm interested in art history. So I was thinking about working in a museum, but then I still want paint. So I don't know how <laughs> like two of them will come together. Together. Yeah. So I will work out as a goal. Well, my personal goal is to teach because the same thing we were talking about just now oh, in yeah, terms teaching, of yeah. how teachers, I guess, discourage, don't, yeah. they discourage yeah. children and don't promote the arts and stuff like that. My goal is to teach because I mean, I feel like even in secondary school and in primary school, I feel like we just learn color theory, yeah. you draw this this way and this is right, and not show them about your imagination. Nothing is wrong with that, and that like, you can take that and make it into something else. So I want to teach and like actually teach them the way in which they could think and broaden their imagination. I feel like yeah, the yeah. way we learn in like secondary school, when we like, not secondary school, when we come into BTC, yeah. the way we learned then, I felt like we should have been learning that from every young, sense. Yeah. because then we would be even better and more conceptually thinking right now. Right. But I think a goal for us together is we want to have a studio and a gallery at one. So it's like every place you see of our sales line is like click, 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 <laughs> click <laughs> just to make sure well yeah. we remember it because i mean you never know in a couple of years the price might get on like uh and we might be able to buy it for ourselves yeah. fingers so. crossed <laughs> <laughs> all day <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome. would you ever consider going to show your pieces like in miami for our basil or anything like that uh, anybody that want me to come yeah <laughs> <I guess. laughs> well as much as much exposure as possible, possible. Yeah. Even if you don't get anything sold, that's just like, what are you going in that? Like, you're not going to get anything 
souls or whatever. But and people are still saying a word, and then more art shows you do is like, oh, I know that girl from last That's show. That's true, yeah. And then you start to build a name. Yeah, it's like, a matter of time and place too, because people assume that well, you big because this, this, and that. Yeah. But sometimes the people that are big are just big because they were in this place at this point in time. Yeah. So it's just a matter of, okay, I like doing art, I enjoy putting my work out there, so let me get my exposure out, and then in turn, it's not that we're looking to get big, but we're really like looking to make a living doing what, what you want to do. Yeah. Because, because struggling. <laughs> exactly. You don't want to be a starving artist. artist. <laughs> we definitely won't want that category. That ain't no cliche. That is saying true. It's true. So would you like to teach, if you had a chance to teach, what age range are you more interested in? Secondary school. <laughs> I would like to I'm teach rich. a master's or a bachelor's. I feel like, I feel like, I don't want, I don't know, I would like to instill a younger generation that you can actually do something art they're yeah. interested, but I don't think the way the, the system is yeah. for secondary school, like they have to follow a specific, a specific yeah. um, like manual or guide. Right, right, yeah. Yeah. And I don't want to do that. I feel like if I go into that, I can start to sell the energy on myself. I feel like I want to do an associate degree because with an associate degree, yeah, maybe in um, that, um, you see where we are now, but we are in my, in our bachelor's. I feel like with an associate degree, you couldn't get any children that just came out of secondary school okay, who don't yeah. know what to expect necessarily in terms of art. And then it's up to you as a teacher to set your own assignments of what you want your oh, children yeah, to do. So you are at that stage where you get to mold them fresh because they're in a new school. So they're basically the babies of the school. And we're getting to form their minds as well as what it is you want them to know. Mm -hmm. It's like that. They're at the perfect stage. It's like they're old enough to grasp what it is you're teaching, but they're still young enough for them to be molded. It's not a tree that can't bend anymore. Uh -huh. They're still young enough. But I'm not in second grade school. It's to be like the first and that set the regime for everyone. Yeah. So that it would be less strict, like copy this, copy this. It should be like, I don't know. Even in the same degree, it's the same, it's the same thing, because I still got to follow a regime, but it's more open. I feel they should be more flexible. Like doing, yeah. yeah. Oh, you mean instead of just saying, okay, put the bottle there and draw it, draw it, draw it, but that's the bottle that you've done. Maybe you could tell them you could shade it a certain way. I use different, different colors. colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or like, I don't know, make a background or something that would like brand out something. I think, I don't know, like, because they were in the teaching that long that it becomes a job. But some of the well, at my school, they were artists, so I don't know. Lucky you. Remember, remember we had a game teacher, teacher, we are in first, she met, we second part. You remember that? She yeah. met, we slip pictures on front of people, people talking about collage. Um, first, then first, oh first, yeah. And instead, let me draw it. Because <laughs> I remember the teacher. I can remember the teacher in first or third farm. That was the uh, yeah, game teacher. Sure. Hey, hold in the names, the names, the names. <laughs> the names, the blame, the lock up. I got out. I remember the game teacher and it was like, she had said that the, usually the, the teachers that teach you are in first or third form are not necessarily important because they're just teaching you the basics, which everybody knows, which is like... Color. Yeah. Blue plus yellow may green, you know, red plus yellow may orange, what blue plus red may purple. Don't know that. I asked the guy how to mix blue and he didn't tell me orange and yellow. Yeah. People don't know that you don't mix blue. Blue. Yeah. It's a mineral. Blue is a color. Yeah. To our soul, to our first ever show. Solo. show well, not really solo, but three of our shows. <laughs> March 27, 4 30 to 10 30. Great music. DJ Deluxe. So be there. Yeah, for sure. To our soul. At Libby's show. Right, Libby's show. We're not the comfortable where we at. Libby.